So there was a report by KTAR, which is the local news channel um, in, in Phoenix, and reported that 30 people, Arizona Department of Public Safety reported that 30 people, only 30 people were arrested for DUI on New Year's Eve. Okay, and I read the article, I posted it on one of the blogs um, earlier in the week, but I posted it and I'll, I'll attach it to this YouTube video, but I don't know where, I would like to find out where they got their statistics, because that can't possibly be right. And I don't know if maybe the DPS, uh, uh, police department issued 30, and then on top of what all the cities did, because our phones, folks have been ringing nonstop for DUIs on New Year's Eve, okay? And uh, we take the time, we listen to these folks. We, even if you don't hire us, we'll provide you with free information, we'll walk you through the process, we'll let you know what to expect. And our advice, our legal advice varies depending on uh, your individual circumstances, so why you were pulled over, results on field sobriety tests, results of portable breath tests, breathalyzer, blood results, etc. And then more specifically, our advice is geared towards the specific court that your case has been assigned to, okay? So when you speak with a lawyer, you have to have a lawyer that's not only experienced with DUIs, but also experienced in your particular court. Because if you don't have experience in the court that you're in, you're wasting your money. The attorney's probably not going to do much of any good. If you were arrested for a DUI on New Year's Eve or at any point in time, give my office a call for free advice, 602-980-1987.